Okay, we are here up on top of Radar Dome for today's run. Um, it's a beautiful day. I'm going to flip this. So anyway, um, this is a place that we go to. I'll go down and take a video of the buildings that are down here where there's a lot of tagging, but it's beautiful artwork on a lot of it. So anyway, I'm having a great day today. <laughs>
video by of the Jeeps that are with us today, which is Sunday. There's Paul that has no windshield. We'll talk about that later. And there's the Jeep leader, Hocus Pocus, Jeep Juice, and the other guy down there. I can't remember what his name is. I'm sorry. Um, anyway, we got beautiful space up here. Able to do a little bit of rock climbing. Nice little fire pit. Little area you can bring your Jeep up on there. Nice, awesome spot. All right, here's an old dilapidated building back here. My husband found himself a mud puddle, which I'm sure he'll come through. I know that ends down there because that's where those people were camping that one time. It doesn't go back super far. Oh, is that probably from yesterday, from the guys? Yeah, for training. Oh, there's let's the change, frogs. Let's change all the lot. Let's change all the codes on it. There's the frogs. <laughs> Thomas, let's go change the codes on it. I think they're trying to hide. To Probably trying to get to their big giant mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna come up here because the U.S. Air Force was doing their survival training here yesterday, and they've been up here all week. well, they've been up here all week. Yes, they have. Um, we saw them yesterday on our run, but back here they have a post, and we're gonna read it real quick because. It's kind of cool and here you go SV 98 a alpha 2332 group camp 621 to 622 shelters not available latrine not available SNA Roberts and there's the signature we got another Jeep going up on the rocks it looks like it might be purple no that's hocus pocus pocus Hang on. All right, she did the fire pit rocks. That's it. Okay, day two of the Jeep run. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Jeeps coming this time. Here we go. We're heading back off to our ride again. Okay. Go ahead. Scrape. No, you're not. Angle's too high. Oh, look at that. Well, don't spray. impressive but stop <laughs> well hang on oh that's been pretty impressive I'm terrified right now oh you're good just don't move just don't move Hey, stay there, Paul. Hang on. All right. You already don't have a windshield. Stop. Nope, stop. Are you trying to hover over and, and uh Get the rock pile under your Jeep. Uh, right. <laughs> Paul is kind of like, you know that live commercial Mikey? Mm -hmm. If we won't Probably do Mikey, it, Mikey will do it. That's, right? that's, he's our Mikey. Well, he's already got an insurance claim out. That's right. What's, a, what's another little few things to it, right? Well, the deer did this. No, the rims got screwed well, up on the other the side. The problem is, is if he does do it, then Big Brother has to do it. And if he does it, then Paul Thomas has to do it. I mean, that's just... It just it rolls. It starts, it starts a thing. Oh! Oh. Good job, Thomas. Nice spot. Ooh. 
The rock did move. I saw that. Let's not take out a transfer case, please. Paul, the reason you got this new... Well, he's over there doing it, smoking a cigarette, hanging out of his mouth, doing his driving, drinking his Pepsi at the same time. He's gonna. <gasps> Fuck, dude. Sorry, my mouth. Hey, he, uh, he, he got it. Kids. He can spend money on this. Oh, oh he's sliding, oh, sliding, oh, sliding. Oh. You're, you're sliding. Oh. Oh, he's gonna break it. He's gonna snap. <laughs> so here he comes. Well, oh, my God. This is. I know, see? You're, that's rocking too much. Okay, baby. He's up. You're up as far as I want you to be. Of course, they're not because he wants to be up there. A little bit more. Six more inches. Three. I'm watching your back end. You're clear. Is that it? It's all in inches. Go up just one little bit more. Push. Good job, it looks good. Hang on. Okay. Slow, slow, slow. Whoa, slow. Almost. We did a little bit of rock climbing up here. Beautiful dispersed campsite area. And we're done. Okay, we're up here on top of Radar Dome for the second day. So we're gonna go talk to Paul and do a quick interview with Paul for a minute here. And he's gonna explain why he does not have a windshield. Sir, uh, first of all, take a good look at his, I gotta take a snapshot. Okay, so why do you look like you do? Well, last Tuesday, I, a deer jumped out in front of me and smashed my windshield. See, there's no windshield. There we go. Yeah. So instead of, uh, yeah, not driving my vehicle on this nice deep run, I decided to just take remove it. Okay, so when's the soonest they can get in to fix your Jeep for when that deer hit you and did the damage it did? Uh, September 25th. So are you going to be trying to like put some saran wrap on it? What's your plan? No, we're going to go ahead and get the, the, the windshield fixed. And for the side door, mirror, I think we can just take out the, the old mirror here. And then we'll have an external mirror when I take my doors off to, to go through the, the window. Yeah, and luckily the man has a set of doors that he could put on when he rides topless and sideless for the summer. Um, and he's a little powdery right now because he's always at the back end of the group, making sure everybody stays on track. So hey, thanks Paul. No uh huh. So here's some more buildings that Carmen and Thomas found through an aerial online. This is the most intact building that's here. It actually even has sort of a door. Trace, look up. Dude, look up.
Ja. And a full ceiling. Mm -hmm. Like that. Wow. And the phone? Mm -hmm. On there? Oh. Well, look through here. You can see really good. Pretty cool. All right. All right, here's the other building that we didn't know about. Some cool artwork on it. Oh, so this is on the other side of the place we were up on top. We didn't see this at all. Go inside over here, and this is the artist SAKS 2022. Let's go out here a little bit. Seek sins scare E9 foul soulish image gozer he bug. I'm recording on the inside here. Cool flower. Look at that mushroom, how it comes out on the phone. What's that? Look at that mushroom. Mm -hmm. Oh, how it comes out in there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, here's something. Whoops. Those who write on bathroom walls roll their shit in tiny balls. Those who read this words of wit eat those tiny balls of shit. Oh my goodness. Another really cool viewpoint. Never seen this before up here. This is cool. When you find new things. It's pretty awesome. Hang on, Jasmine! Officially. Didn't I just talk about fenders? You wanted metal ones, right? Careful, Carmen. Did she lose both her fenders? Did you get a picture of this? <laughs> wow! I did actually film that. I guess you're getting fenders. <laughs> Thomas is coming up the far left. Hang on. Up, oh, nope. I told him, I said, you look like you're too scared to do this. 
We do this up at the Seven Mile. I was gonna say park. this is. This is nothing. It's fun though. It's, these kind it's of things fun. are just fun to get out yeah. and for a day. Oh. Almost, Thomas. Oh, geez. Are, you, are you just doing this in two? You're just doing this in two, aren't you? Tied up. Oh my! <laughs> I wish I had my radar tape. You can bypass it. I know. <laughs> you just yeah. Good job! You got it, T. Keep it on the lock. Put your helmet on. Hey, <laughs> mom. Hey, mom. Oh, he's got his goggles, his though. Goggles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, Jim. And this is how Paul is driving his Jeep. <laughs> Take a look at his goggles there. See? He's got his goggles on. He's good to go. And over here, we did lose a fender or two. So, she wanted new fenders, so there you go. Great opportunity to upgrade.